How's it going, everybody? You're watching Tech Rushy, and today I'm going to teach you how you can do this. That's right. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set any song as your iPhone ringtone for free. No sketchy apps, no hidden fees, just the official way. And yes, you can use any song or audio file you want. Let's dive in. All you need is one app, GarageBand. If you're thinking, wait, I don't have that, then don't sweat it. GarageBand comes pre-installed on every iPhone. If you deleted it, no worries. Just head to the App Store, search for GarageBand, and download it. It's totally free and an official Apple app. I'll drop a direct link in the description below to make it even easier for you. Once you've got GarageBand open, it'll launch in landscape mode. Swipe right a few times until you see the audio recorder option. Tap on it, and we're ready to roll. First, check the metronome icon at the top. If it's blue, tap it to turn it off. It should be white. Next, tap the brick wall icon, third from the left, to bring up the timeline. Now, tap on the plus icon, which can be tricky to tap. I got it on the second try, but it usually takes a few attempts. Once you're in, tap section A, turn off automatic, and manually set the length to 30 seconds. This is the perfect length for a ringtone. Tap outside the menu to confirm, and you'll see the timeline adjust. Now it's time to select our audio, the song or file we want as our ringtone. To do this, tap on the loop icon, second from the right, then tap on files. As you can see, GarageBand is compatible with almost any audio file type. AIFF, WAV, CAF, Apple Loop, AAC, MP3, MIDI, and more. So you can choose any audio file. We'll get it from the Files app, which is pre-installed on your iPhone. There are many ways to add songs or audio files to the Files app. You can transfer them from a computer, another iPhone, or even download them directly from the web. For this video, I'm using a Zedge website. I'll download the ringtone and it will appear in the Files app under Downloads. Once the file is in the Files app, go back to GarageBand, tap Browse Files app, and select the song you just downloaded. Tap and hold the file, then drag it to the beginning of the timeline. You can preview it by tapping the play button. If you want to adjust the starting point, tap on the track, edit it, and move it to your desired position. Once you're happy, tap the down arrow, the first icon on the left, to save the song. It will create your ringtone. Tap and hold the saved file, then tap share. Select the ringtone option. Give it a name. I'll call mine Tech Rushy Ringtone. And export it. Once exported, you can exit GarageBand. Finally, open your settings, go to sounds and haptics, tap ringtone, and you'll see your newly created ringtone listed there. And that's it, folks. You've just turned any song or audio file into your iPhone ringtone completely free and 100% official. If you found this tutorial helpful, smash that like button, drop a comment letting me know what song you're using, and don't forget to subscribe to Tech Rushy for more awesome tech tips like this. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Until then, stay safe.